this is Gay Pan for Goat. Hey, who let that goat out? <laughs> There is a place where the lost embers go as their light begins to fade. Ember ran because standing still made them feel helpless. The wall glistened. The painting showed embers on a sacred journey. Ember felt so afraid and alone that it was a relief to find someone to talk to. Ember froze, almost too frightened to look away, when they noticed a small satchel. felt heavy. Ember looked inside. The statue shone brightly in the light. There was a symbol on the floor. Ember noticed something wrong.
there was a round space where something used to fit. To Ember's delight, the golden statue slid perfectly into place. Ember left, feeling sorry for the stranger now alone in the dark. The stairway opened into a dark forest. Ember could feel fear taking over. They'd washed up alone, somewhere very unfamiliar. Ember felt like they were being watched. The foxes howled into the night. The only reply was silence. The path was blocked. As Ember approached, the flames seemed to call out. With a feeling like falling, the forest had slipped away. Ember felt lost in darkness and ruin. Caged flame stoked new hope in Ember. Hope was almost within reach. The flame spoke and Ember listened. The flame lingered ahead. Was it trying to escape? Or leading the way? Fire flickered into life. The ghost spoke. Hope has returned to a forlorn. I will warm them until they choose to move on. Ember looked to the ghost for answers. This is a place between places. To travel through as your light fades. But none have passed on in a long time. The Forest King now holds us here. 
and those who linger will turn forlorn. Again, that word, forlorn. The forlorn are those who lost their way along the path. If you find them, send them to me and I will guide them. I am just a guide along the way to fan the flame. So many lost embers have I seen, more than I could help. Ember thought of those they loved, those they'd left behind. The forest king watches the doors. The campfire will light the way. Find those who are lost, bring embers to the fire. There are others lost along their journey. Find them and I will guide them. Step backwards, little ember. Look behind. Upon a small grassy cliff rests a forlorn. The old gate was locked. The crow held its shining trophy tight. He was nestled between the reeds, but it was just out of reach. Inside was a scrap of journal. The strangers on the water went on without me. Where have I landed? Vines and thorns stretch out to trip me. The stranger whispered, Ever feel like you are being watched? I've never felt that. What does it feel like? Is it nice? It sounds nice. The worm looked helpless, with no way to escape. As Ember picked it up, the worm let out a little yelp. <coughs> the Wanderer's Diary Unfamiliar trees, a path overgrown, is this a resting place? A place between places? I call out, but mine is the only voice.
broken net hung ominously around the skeleton's neck. The stranger shivered in the cold. They'd moved through such dark places. They lay down and closed their eyes. was a distant memory stolen by the passing miles. The stranger blinked at Embo. Is it morning already? How long have I been asleep? Barely visible through the murky water was the shadow of something hiding, and on a small pier with barely a sound, a lonely fisherman sat. The traveller spoke. You ever had roast frog, friend? I miss a good roast frog. Oh, how they crackle. The stranger had been forgotten. They tried to follow as best they could. But no one heard them when they fell behind.
stranger looked at Ember with surprise. Someone came back for me. Thank you. Traveller said, You sailed in here. Where's your boat? Friend, you need a boat. Go see the builder in the caves. Tell them I'm sorry I never came back. The stranger had blazed their own path, created their own rock, their own islands. They did not need Ember's kindness. But still, Ember stayed. Building a bridge should it ever be needed. The stranger met Ember's eyes. The two shared a moment of silence. <laughs> 